On Sunday, April 28, a destructive outbreak of severe weather swept through Oklahoma. The National Weather Service office in Norman, Oklahoma, set a record for the number of tornado warnings issued in one day 59. Tornadoes resulted in the deaths of four people in the state, and at least 100 individuals were injured. Over 40,000 people were left without power. One rare EF-4 tornado and at least two EF-3 tornadoes destroyed entire communities in Oklahoma over the weekend. This marks the first EF-4 tornado in Oklahoma since 2016. The most severe damage was reported in the towns of Sulphur and Holdenville. Oklahoma Governor Kevin Stitt reported that approximately 30 people were injured in Sulphur alone. The destruction there was extensive. Authorities stated that the tornado in Sulphur began in City Park and then moved through the downtown area, where it destroyed many buildings, flipped cars and buses, and tore roofs off houses within a 15-block radius. Surviving structures had windows and doors blown out. Business owners on West Muscogee Avenue were shocked to find that a significant portion of the bustling downtown, featuring art galleries, restaurants, and other shops, had simply vanished. Many people sought shelter from the storm and tornado in the gymnasium of the local high school. Jacqueline Wright shared that the sound of the tornado touching down resembled a helicopter.